We're trying to get the brain to communicate with the adrenal glands properly again. We're trying to reset the HPA axis. Because guess what? When you do that and then you stop the program, you've still got the HPA axis working properly. They had The only way they could reset HPA axis function such that the HPA would work properly when the program was stopped was with ultra low dosages spread throughout the day. Timmons used to always call it a physiological dose, a dose that would mimic the normal production to get the brain to see normal circulating levels to get the brain to start to tell the adrenal glands to do the right thing again. It's a trick, it's an elaborate con job really on your brain. We're mimicking normal production with these liquid DHEA and pregnenolone products and we're manipulating cortisol up and down with, with uh, licorice root and phosphorine. It's an elaborate trick to get cortisol levels normal in the bloodstream and DHEA normal in the bloodstream. And then the brain thinks that it's telling the adrenals to do that and this feedback loop resets. Anyways, that's the theory behind it anyways. It, it really does work quite well. And but if you don't use the liquids and you don't spread the dosages out, then it has a, it's not a bad thing to do it differently, but it just doesn't work for the resetting process.